As the political turmoil continues in Egypt, the number of people crossing between the Gaza Strip and Egypt continues to decline. Now, less than 100 people are allowed to leave the tiny coastal enclave through the Rafah crossing, compared to nearly 1,500 people prior to the ouster of Egyptian President Mohamed Morsi. Egyptian authorities also allow a maximum of two busloads of travelers to reach the Gaza Strip on a daily basis. The situation is miserable for people leaving and entering Gaza. I had to wait for three days on the Egyptian side of the Rafah crossing just to enter Gaza. My brother and his family are stranded in Gaza and they cannot travel because of the Egyptian restrictions. The situation is negatively affecting the people of Gaza, especially students and patients. There are hundreds of chronic patients in Gaza in need for urgent medical attention abroad due to lack of the necessary treatment in Gaza. The closure of Rafah border has serious side effects on the health status in Palestine. Uh, from here, I would like to ask all international medical organizations to support the health status in Gaza so that they can avoid a crisis in the health situation in Gaza. In mid-July, Egypt temporarily reopened the Rafah crossing, but thousands are still stranded in both sides of the Rafah crossing, as the number of people allowed to leave Gaza has been declining day in and day out. People were also dissatisfied by the treatment they receive at the Egyptian side of the Rafah crossing. We uh, deserve uh, much better treatment from the Egyptian side. I think the procedure on uh, uh, Rafah crossing is uh, so hard for the passenger, especially for Palestinian. Uh, traveling uh, through uh, Rafah crossing is uh, uh, something hard and uh, really uh, uh, disastrous. With the holy month of Ramadan drawing to an end, the number of people who would want to travel is likely to increase. Palestinians in the Gaza Strip say there is no end in sight to their suffering amid the escalating political tensions in Egypt. Rafah crossing is the besieged Gaza's only gateway to the outside world, bypassing Israel. Ashraf Shannon, Press TV Gaza.